Off to top tonight. Today, police in Prince George's County announced they've arrested a man for the murder of a Greenbelt teacher. This comes more than a month after the teacher was reported missing. We've heard from many concerned community members in that time since. Our Josh Rosenthal is in Greenbelt tonight with what we know at this point. Josh? Guys, this park is the last place and Marion Sela was seen alive. And if you follow me over here, look in this direction, you'll see there are still some missing signs with her picture posted nearby. I'm trusting God that she's still alive. That was the hope. But weeks later, this community is now coming to grips with the sad reality that a beloved school teacher is gone. And I uh, still had hope that we can st where they can still find her alive. Good afternoon. At a Friday press conference, police hey, revealed that the dismembered body of 59-year-old Mariam Sila had been found in early August in Clinton. Sila was a teacher at the Dora Kennedy French Immersion School in Greenbelt, which is only a few miles from this park called Shram Hills Recreation Center, where Sila was last seen July 29th. So this is a very sad day, very sad outcome. 33-year-old Harold Landon III is now accused of murdering Sela after authorities say cell phone records showed Landon was both in the area of Shram Hills Rec Center the night Sela disappeared and he was in the area of where Sela's remains were found near a pond in Clinton two days later on July 31st. And I don't believe they knew each other. I just think we have a person who decided to go out and commit a horrific crime. Is it just terrible? David Bimby told us he's a friend of Sila, who he'd see almost every day taking walks here in the park. It's very heartbroken because uh, she was a very, very wonderful person. Landon is expected to have a bond hearing on Tuesday. Police tell us he's actually been locked up since August 1st on what they call an unrelated assault charge. Guys.